lock the scrum and play the advantage. Tonight, an Australian kangaroo angers a pride of lions. And also, a rooster and a shark go toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Then later, a Queensland maroon is ready to rumble. Here at Lock the Scrum, we look to share with non-rugby league viewers a broad description from a fan's point of view. The big hits, the big fights, and the big characters. This is Lock the Scrum, and now this episode is on the way. Aussie Stadium, New South Wales, the Tri-Nation Series, the Australian Kangaroos host the Great Britain Lions. The Lions are looking to get out of their own half. Stuart Fielden runs up with the ball, but he gets tangled up in a three-man tackle. Fielden gets up and walks towards Willie Mason. He reaches out. Mason fires off a big right hand, and Stuart Fielden goes down hard. Another Englishman moves in, but gets taken out by another Australian. All of a sudden, Great Britain's Jamie Peacock and the Australian Willie Mason trade monstrous blows. The trouble starts here. After Fielden gets tackled by three Australians, he plays the ball and begins to walk towards Willie Mason. He reaches out, Mason strikes Fielden, and Jamie Peacock jumps in to defend his team member. Here's a different angle. Stuart Fielden moves forward. He grabs Mason's jersey. Mason lets one go. Fielden goes face down into the dirt. Mason and Peacock continue to hurl insults towards one another and they're told to get on with the game without instigating. In the wild, kangaroos and lions would never do battle, but on the international rugby league landscape, everybody fights to be on top of the food chain. Points Bet Stadium, New South Wales, Round 24, of the National Rugby League regular season, it's the Cronulla Sutherland Sharks versus the Sydney Roosters. The Sharks kick the ball from right to left to start the game. The Roosters use Mark O'Mealy and David Shillington to create a dent in the armor of the Sharks' defensive line. David Shillington receives the ball again and runs up the middle for tackle number four. The captain, Paul Gallen, wraps up Shillington with the assistance of other Sharks the Sharks release Shillington from the tackle, but the captain, Paul Gallen, holds on. Then all of a sudden, they both trade punches. The trouble starts here. Shillington receives the ball. He runs straight. The Sharks' defensive line cuts him off. Gallen shoots his arm under with a tightening grip. Shillington plays the ball, and punches begin to fly. Here's a different angle. Gallen goes under and squeezes his neck. He plays the ball and shoves Gallen. They both trade punches. Then everybody joins in. In the end, the penalty goes against Paul Gallen for a grapple tackle. He is sent away, and the Roosters gain possession. The Sydney Roosters have been a dominant force for years, but in Points Bet Stadium, there's a shark feeding frenzy. Stadium Australia, New South Wales, game one of the State of Origin series. The New South Wales Blues host the Queensland Maroons. 50 minutes in, New South Wales are leading Queensland 14 points to zero. Blues player Eric Groth Jr. makes a dash from the dummy half position. He gets tackled by the Queenslander Justin Hodges. Hodges strips the ball from Groth, and the referee calls for a turnover to Queensland. 
growth pushes Hodges, and they get into each other's face. Then all of a sudden, punches begin to fly. The trouble starts here. Eric Grove Jr. swiftly makes his way to the dummy half position to collect the ball. He bursts with speed towards Hodges. Hodges makes the tackle. He steals the ball, and they slug it out. Here's a different angle. Justin gets up. He holds up a clinched fist. Eric Grove throws a punch, and Justin Hodges replies in kind. Other players rush in. The game's official talks to Grove and Hodges, and he sends them away with a stern warning. Queensland receive a penalty, and the game is allowed to proceed. In the state of origin, you need to be cool, calm, and collected. But when tempers rise, punches need to fly. This has been a presentation from Rock the Scrum. If you enjoyed this content, then leave a thumbs up, comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Well, folks, that's all the time we have for you. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.